And welcome, this is Baller Scuba with more Let's Play Skyrim. I'm joined, as always, by my overcrowded party of Gulag Malarg, Shadowmare, Ayla the Huntress, and Serana, who's refusing to stay in formation here. When we last left off, we made it to a castle. I went ahead and dumped all my excess equipment, and we are hopefully ready to go inside. I just noticed that there are gargoyles here, though, so I have a feeling they're going to spawn on me and uh, want to kill us all. After all the last ones that we saw spawned. No? All right, she's here, so... I guess these guys are not going to try to destroy me. Hooray! Let's uh let's try to head inside. Hey, so before we go in there. It's a little late now. W I mean, what is it, Serata? I wanted to thank you for getting me this far. But after we get in there, I'm going to go my own way for a while. I think. Can I have the I scroll? Know your friends would probably want to kill everything in here. I'm hoping you can show some more control than that. Once we're inside, just keep quiet for a bit. Let me take the lead. Lady Serana's back. Open the gate. I make no guarantees I won't kill everything in here. I don't know if you guys know my track record. You have anything more to say? Oh, what is it? Uh, nope. All right. Way well, I hear it, Lady Serana's been gone a real long time. You're the watchman, shouldn't you know? Uh, let's go into Volkahar Keep and see what else is going on around here. We're going to finish this, and then we're going to go back and find out what happened to Tormund. Well, we know what happened to Tormund, but we don't officially know because the game didn't catch on yet. How dare you trespass here? Um, Wait, Serana? Is that truly you? Ayla didn't make it. I cannot believe my eyes. And then he just walks away. S Serana, are we... My lord, everyone! Serana has returned! Hooray! As I'm expected. I can't believe it. So I have to go speak to Harkon. Or Harkin. My long lost daughter returns daughter. at last. I oh. trust you have my Elder Scroll. After all these years, that's the first thing you ask me? Yes, I have the scroll. Of course I'm delighted to see you, my daughter. Must I really say the words aloud? Ah, if only your traitor mother were here. I would let her watch this reunion before putting her head on a spike. Now tell me. Who is this stranger you have brought into our hall? This is my savior, the one who freed me. For my daughter's safe return, you have my gratitude. Hey, how you doing? Gulag Malark. What is your name? Vampire Hunter. You first? His name is Lord Harkon. I am aware of his name. I'm Gulag Malark. Who the hell are you? I am Harkon, Lord of this court. By now, my daughter would have told you what we are. Wasn't hard to figure out. You guys are actually eating in front of me, so I can, uh, I can guess. You're also a reclusive cannibal cult. That is kind of true, too, or I don't really care. Let's just say you're vampires. Not just vampires. We are among the oldest and most powerful vampires in Skyrim. Ah, and right. For vampires. centuries we lived here far from the cares of the world. All that ended when my wife betrayed me and stole away that which I valued most. Your Elder Scroll. Uh, do I get a reward? Let's not, uh, let's not make the, the vampires around me, you know, angry. I don't know how powerful this guy is, if we're going to be Anne Rice-style vampires or Underworld-style vampires. Yeah, I don't know. This could be bad. So, uh, what happens now? You have done me a great service. And now you must be rewarded. Please don't there bite me. There is but one gift I can give that is equal in value to the Elder Scroll and my daughter. He's gonna I bite me. I offer you my blood. Take it and you will walk as a lion among sheep. Men will tremble at your approach and you will never fear death again. Can I talk this over with my wife? She might be uh, a little bit concerned about, you know, my blood flow. 
just a thought. Uh, oh, apparently my only option here is, and if I refuse your gift? Then you will be prey, like all mortals. I will spare your life this once, but you will be banished from this hall. Perhaps you still need convincing. Behold the power! This is the power that I offer. Now, make your choice. Okay, number one, that was cool. But number two, it was cooler when it was all red. When you turned into like a gargoyle thing, it, it stopped being as cool. Uh, I'm going to try it out. I'm going to say yes. I will accept your gift and become a vampire. Be still. I'll try. I don't even let my life, wife do that to me. Then again, she probably can't. All right, so I'm a vampire now. And I'm in third person. No, I'm not. All right. It's just, just a hit of the button. And, Awake and at last. Good. The power is growing within you. And now you must learn to wield it. Is it going to be better than Werewolf? I was disappointed in Werewolf. Uh, what is this place? A shrine to Molag Bal, the mighty Daedra Prince who is father to all our kind. Yeah, I met him. Our power is a blessing from him. It is he who first bestowed the gift of the ancient blood upon me. Oh, directly. You made a pact with Molag Bal? In an age long forgotten to history, I ruled as a mighty king. My domain was vast, my riches endless, and my power infinite. Well, obviously not and infinite. Yet, as my mortal life neared an end, I faced a seemingly invincible enemy. My own mortality. I pledged myself to Molag Ball, and in his name I sacrificed a thousand innocents. Vlad? In reward, he gave everlasting life to myself, my wife, and my daughter. And so I have defeated mortality itself. Well, it's like a truce right now, because I can, you know, make mortality wind real quick right now if I wanted to. Uh, let's, let's just go with what happened. How did I get here? My blood is potent. At first, the body is overwhelmed by it. After my bite, you collapsed and fell into a slumber. Now your flesh has acclimated to the new blood that courses through your veins. I assure you, no harm was done. In truth, your strength surprises me. Surprises a lot of people. Not all mortals can withstand my embrace. It was a little uncomfortable at first, but I got used to it, you know? I mean, I'm ready to learn about my new powers. With my guidance, you will become a deadly instrument, striking terror into the hearts of mortals wherever you tread. Now listen to my words and do as I instruct. The true power of the ancient blood is found in the form of the Vampire Lord. Assume the mantle of the Vampire Lord. And we will continue. Use my vampire lord power. Uh, powers are, are here, yeah? All right, uh, vampire lord. Transform into a vampire lord. Use the revert form power to change back. Go for it. Transform into the vampire lord. Ooh, magey. In this form. You can drain the life from your foes with your right hand. With your left hand, you can wield the power of blood magic to raise the dead. That does sound good. You can also call upon the powers of night to turn into a swarm of bats and reappear some distance away. Should you run out of magicka, you can descend to the ground and fight as the beasts do. Do so now, and we will continue. Can I fly? All right, press control to swing to change between magic and melee. Good. You are weaker while on the ground because you cannot access the blood magic. However, the night That's powers good. are still yours to command, and your claws are still formidable weapons. I Over time, 
Your powers will grow in strength, and you will find new ways to use your gifts. Alright, look at the perk tree for the Vampire Lord. Alright, let's see what we got. Uh, bonus to health, magic, and stamina. Killing a person with a power attack bite restores all your health. Night powers and blood magic cost less. Melee attacks do 20 points of poison damage. In combat, you are surrounded by a cloud of bats that feed on enemies within melee range. Okay, I like the sound of that one. I do like the sound of that one. This one does not sound good. Detect all creatures, even dwarven automatons. Mm. Uh, transform into an invulnerable mist while health, magicka, and stamina regenerate. Everything slows down while you move faster. That's good. That is also good. Can pull a creature to you from a distance and do choking damage once it's close. Oh, I can Jedi choke it. Little Sith choke, technically, but still. Uh, I can conjure a gargoyle. And I can paralyze my target. There's some good stuff in here. I like this. I like that. All right, so uh, what am I doing here? There is much to learn, but if you master the powers of the Vampire Lord, few enemies will be able to stand against you. Few do already, but uh, select your powers from your favorite menus. All right, we got bats, raise dead, revert form, vampire's sight. Apparently I'm on bats now. Do I kill there him? one last thing you must know. Slaying mortal men with your life drain grants you new night powers and blood magic. So him? I keep a stable of thralls in the castle should you need to feed like the base of vampires to stave off the sun. That is all I have to teach you. If you wish to be reminded of these lessons, you need only ask. I have a task that will test your new powers. But first, do you have any questions? Uh, what must I know about being a vampire? As a vampire, you will gain new powers, but also a weakness to sunlight. Yeah, I can With each that. passing day that you do not feed, that weakness will become more deadly, but your powers will also become stronger. Yeah, it's usually my favorite. Feed upon those who are sleeping, and your vulnerability to sunlight will diminish along with your powers. I'll figure out how to cure this eventually, I'm sure, because it doesn't sound like I want to stick with this forever, but uh, we'll have fun with it while it lasts. All right, what's the task? Good. Go and speak to Garen Marethi. Tell him it is time. He will understand. Oh. Now they want me to revert form. I, okay. There was a little bit of a delay on it, but uh, we're back now. I do like how even my uh, my armor is covered in, in blood. At least when I transform. Doesn't look like there's really anything in here. He's, he's a little wary. Ooh, infinite blood. All right, so we are going to complete at least a few tasks as a vampire they should all be on my side now right you you are not the guy you're welcome here as long as you don't overfeed on the thralls sorry about your nose how are you doing i'm about Garrett? the petty squabbles here i have lived for far too long to be bothered with them i saw more than enough political maneuvering in my time in house dress i was tired of it then I'm tired of it now. It's been a long time since I've heard about houses being that important. But anyway, I have a message from Harkon. Lord Harkon, remember your place. I didn't have a choice. Now, what is our Lord's wish? He simply said, it is time. Well, well. He wants the chalice then. Of course. You've heard of the Bloodstone Chalice? Nope. Of course, as in everyone. And of course, uh, the newest recruit has to have the most important mission. So tell me about this chalice. It is a rather well-kept secret. The chalice has been in Lord Harkin's possession for quite some time now. It is, when used properly, able to increase the potency of our powers. 
He has neglected using it for ages. If he wants it filled now, then grander things are afoot. This is good. Follow me. I'll take you to it. Oh. Lord Harkon has never cared to use the chalice, relying on his more than adequate powers until now. This is an intriguing change. Excuse us. I need to fetch the Bloodstone Chalice. The Chalice? Why? What are you up to, Garan? Lord Harkon's orders, Ortheolf. Calm yourself. Why, why is your face Our so dark? Our friend here has been ordered to fill the Chalice. Really? Everyone's Indeed. face is kind of dark. He's off to Redwater Dead. Well then, best of luck to you. Vingalmo and Ortheolf are Harkon's primary advisors. I'm sure they're quite surprised to learn that you're taking the chalice. They, they seem upset about it, but uh, that's not too surprising to me right now. I don't know if you guys know of all the stuff that I've done. Probably the feast not. The never ends here in Castle Volgahar. And here we are. Now, this chalice needs to be filled directly from the bloodspring that is the source of Redwater Den. But that's not enough. Once that's done, the blood of a powerful vampire needs to be added to it. Keep in mind that Redwater Den has fallen into... Well, let's just say less reputable members of society now dwell there. Kill them, okay. It's your choice whether to attempt to deal with them or force your way through. I'll give diplomacy a shot. Hurry back. You don't want to keep Lord Harkon waiting. All right, take the Bloodstone Chalice to... Oh, they just gave it to me. Take it to Redwater Spring and then uh, probably kill everybody there. Seriously, guys, you guys have skooma? I am All above. Right. He squabbles here. I have lived for far too long to be bothered with them. So it sounds like I'm going to be by myself here? Oh, thank you for teaching me about horses. They can handle harsh terrain. <sighs> Ah, your vampire blood boils in the sunlight. Can I fast travel? You guys are going to still let me fast travel, right? You're not going to make me wait inside. Holy crap, where the hell is this? So much further than I thought it was going to be. Also, uh, for whatever reason, when I'm up there, it like really zooms in. I don't know. It's a little weird, the angle that we're taking here. Um, have I been here? No. Fast travel? Yes. I'm not going to be... Uh, in an intense amount of pain when I get there, am I? Like, dead because I fast-traveled in the sunlight? There's a cave here. Perfect hideout for bandits, or worse. Vampire seduction added. Necromage. Shouldn't you be on my side? Oh, I took away your mace, didn't I? Oh, that's my bad. Well, that's not, that's not what I wanted to do. That is, that is not what I wanted to do. Forgot that, that uh, I took that away. I just completely took everything off of her. Not bad. I'll take it. You can have this now. I'm still here. It's probably better than that. What do you need to take? Yeah, I forgot that, uh, well, she didn't have it equipped, so that's why I took it off of her. Here you go. Probably better than what you had. Lead on, then. All right, we are off uh, this general direction, I guess. Does it actually hurt when I'm in the sunlight? It doesn't look like it. I've gone between shade and sun and I don't see any damage just yet. Can I kill an elk and suck its blood? Is that an option for me? Probably not. But uh, we are off yet again. We need to go south, actually. Even though, eh, whatever. We will get there eventually. So what is this uh, vampire seduction that I have? Uh, they won't fight for 30 seconds. Apparently that's how long it takes to seduce somebody. Uh, Reanimate a more powerful dead body to fight for you for 60 seconds and improve night vision for 60 seconds. I mean, that's something. It's no berserker rage, but... Uh, it is something. So after running away, I'm I'm right back here. Um, elixir of defender on the ground. Uh, what can I can I like? I can't really do anything with you, can I? 
Apparently I don't bite people like a normal vampire like I'm used to. I'll have to transform into a vampire lord. I have a feeling I'm only supposed to do that at night though. 